We love you, Wesley. Looking at my watch, think it's about that time. Yeah. What's good, Bully Fam? TBK West back with another video. Yes, sir. Today is the day, man. Got that semen coming. Um, so what I did was I did right before the semen gets here, I did a progesterone test and I skipped y'all. I, I, I skipped all the extras and we got the results right away. So we are two days after ovulation. Let's take a look at her numbers. Whoa, whoa. 21 nanograms so yes sir that's uh really just for me um i told y'all if you breed two days after ovulation three days after ovulation four days after after ovulation even five days after ovulation you will still have a good chance of getting your litter man so even if this number says 34 or some shit or if it, even if it just said 12 or something there's still a good chance that our females are gonna take, man. So this is a perfect situation, man. I'm glad it worked out like this so y'all can see it. Um, we're gonna try to do the, you know, the same thing with here. You know what I mean? We're gonna try to do that same thing, man. That same thing, man. All right, so update, quick update, man. As y'all can see, Glorilla is gone, bro. Oh yeah, I added another cage right here too, man. I always have. Have full, but yeah, man, Glorilla was rehomed, man. My man gave me an offer I couldn't refuse. Shout out to my guy, just getting his kennel started, man. Uh, he out of Florida, um, I think Tampa, but yeah, man. Square business, man. Appreciate you, bro. His name is Trey, man. So good looking, bro. But uh, yeah, man. Pretty much that's it, bro. We got. Oh, also, man, I got a new centrifuge. Yes, sir. Got that big boy. Yeah, man, I grabbed this because, you know, it's good to have a centrifuge with different levels. You know what I'm saying? You know, with this one right here, it's like only one set. You know what I'm saying? Certain things, you know, um, you, you may not need to spin that fast. And you could, you know, that could be harmful to whatever you're spinning. So I had to get one with some adjustments. Got that big boy, you know. Also about to order a, a microscope too, man. A better microscope. This is like a little cheap one I always had, but it worked also. It show you the semen swimming, but I'm gonna give me a lot, a bigger and better one, man. And uh, I definitely got to get it soon because my boy, young boy, got a breeding coming up. Young boy. You ready to work? Yeah, man, so I wanna make sure that I can do that with any other new studs I have as well, man. I wanna be able to check that semen, man, so. Yes, sir, man. It's a little bit more spacious in this bad boy, too. But my bad if my, let me, hold on, let me wipe it off. I don't know if my screen was foggy, man. Sorry about that, y'all, but yes, sir, man. 21 that semen should be landing in about the next hour or two man so y'all hold tight let's get to it man all right let's get it Damn. all right man so we here man i got my girl effie in the back right here we got the semen down can y'all see that we got the semen with us yeah man so what uh, y'all can see i decided to do the uh surgical man so i'm about to knock the surgical out and uh yes sir man i'll keep y'all updated all right and um yeah y'all hold tight y'all stay tuned oh that's a machine i thought it was a car All right, Bully fam, so um, our girl Effie is in right now getting her surgery done. Um, I had to make a decision, and my decision was based off of, you know, just like 
Okay, so when, when my female um, TBK Lola took from Westgate Kennels, um, damn, what was the name of that dog? They in New Mexico. West, oh, it's Chucky. Westgate Kennels Chucky in New Mexico sent me the semen, shot it in there, let it warm, let it cool down myself, shot it in there, didn't take. Second time, er, I said, hey, send it. So we did the second go around, she took. Now, you know, I had to do a whole lot of refreshing in my memory. You know, y'all y'all might not know, but it's only like a 20% chance when you get the semen ship and you just shoot it in there. You know, it's like, it's really luck. So what I had to do was I had to, you know, bite the bullet, go ahead and pay this money to uh, get the surgical done, y'all. To just, you know, um, to make sure, just to raise my chances. And also, just for those people that are new breeders out there, when it comes to surgicals, a lot of people might feel like I did a surgical, I'm good. A lot of other factors play a part in these surgicals, man. Like you gotta make sure the progesterone numbers is right. You know, you spin the semen down, you gotta separate the semen. You gotta make sure you don't separate the semen too fast. You could kill the sperm. It's just so many different things, bro, that you gotta be on point with that also go along with the, the surgical, you feel me? So, I'm pretty confident that, I don't know if I did everything correctly, correctly, but I'm pretty confident that we looking real good. Like, the percentages, the chances of Miss Effie taking are really high, man. So, yeah, man. Um, I just had to make sure that, you know, I, I don't miss this litter. We just had uh, Cardi pass away, RIP. Like I said, I was uh, looking forward to that litter, but we do got Maya coming in. He also um, in another week or two. And I don't know, I might. I might attempt to uh, spin the semen down myself. I did just buy a new centrifuge. I was thinking about spinning the semen down myself and trying myself just so I could say I did it. You know what I'm saying? But yes sir man um that's pretty much it um shout out to the homie eddie man if y'all don't know this is uh eddie from major league frenchie's uh crib that we at man uh, eddie is most famous for having the first hairless frenchie uh, in america for 150k Yeah, bro can't wait man to confirm this litter uh i'll probably still wait until we can actually see something till she get a baby bump or something because sometimes you know you do have the option to hit that ultrasound man so ultrasound you can i've gotten i could do a relaxing test too but the relaxing test show, uh, gave me the best results around day 30 to 35 for a dog so you know at that point you might as well you know, waiting for the x-rays or whatever, but yes, sir, man, it's going down, man, y'all hold tight, all right, man, Let's grab some pads real quick, man, from Costco, man, so you see, man, them bad boys, $20 for a hundred, man, I right, can't beat that, man, $20 for a hundo, all right, if you look online, it might say $35 or some shit, when you get your membership, your Costco membership, $20 for a hundo. All right, Bully fam, we back at the crib, man. Had a long day, about to wrap it up. I'm pretty confident that she uh, should take, man. Uh, like I told y'all, it's no guarantee. It's no guarantee with a surgical, or AI, anything, man. You know, every dog is different, so. Yeah, man, we gonna wrap it up. We out of here, man. I'll see y'all later, man, all right? Like and subscribe if you enjoyed this content, man. TVK West, I'm out of here. Love you, Wesley. Looking at my watch, think it's about that time.